time, I give her an oil change. And while I'm at it, I'm gonna give her a clutch replacement and some new springs and the whole shebang. Put that under the bike. Open the top cap. This is an 18 millimeter box wrench. Real black, real dirty. Just a little bit on each bolt. There's a little uh, ledge on the side here. You stick this and press it against the cover and you hammer it out. So you got the clutch plates in here and the springs are underneath this plate. Everything's enclosed in a, I guess you call it a basket. And now the next step is to remove these bolts. Remove two diagonal bolts and the remaining two, you just uh, loosen them evenly, little by little, to uh, release the spring tensions. That's the second one. And just go back and forth. And what we have left are four springs. I bought new ones. These are gone. Next, you're going to have to deal with a uh, interesting nut here. This is um, a nut that you need a special tool for, a spanner nut. It looks like this. It has four uh, protruding corners and it fits right over there. Before you start loosening it, there is a tiny little uh, bent, I don't know what this is called. It locks the nut in place and what you need to do is you gotta bend this back out so it, it frees the nut. Okay, so now that's out of the way, let's loosen it. Notice if you try and take it off, it spins freely. So I put it in fifth gear and then I'm gonna apply the brakes real tight and then it's gonna come off, hopefully. <laughs> All right. Okay, there we have it. Do not lose this. There's a washer, don't forget that too. Now you can proceed to pulling out all the uh, clutch discs. What we're replacing is the individual discs. Check the surface of these discs and if it's just too shiny, you want to kind of scuff it up with a very fine grit sandpaper so it catches. That's right. That's right. Yeah. That was magic. Okay. Now everything is done backwards. You put this on. And then tighten it. New springs from EVC. Be long. Okay, put the bracket back on. This 
This right here is my very favorite tool. Tap. And that's how you torque it. Now I gotta fill up the oil. 